Did you know that a PGA Tour player can earn a lifetime membership just by doing one thing? Players can never lose the PGA Tour status after obtaining a lifetime membership. No matter how they play, they remain on tour. Before we get into the requirements of a lifetime membership on the PGA Tour, let's talk about something you probably don't know. Here are the perks of being a PGA golfer. First, what does it mean to earn a PGA Tour membership? Being called a PGA Pro is certification, meaning you have instant credibility with fans and the general public as a professional golfer. The biggest benefit of becoming a PGA professional is the right to say, I am a PGA Pro. Here's something else you don't know. As a struggling golfer trying to earn PGA Pro status, you need a lot of stuff. And the most significant is money. You'll need to get golfing equipment, and you'll need to pay to be able to play anywhere. Once you become a PGA Pro, all that stuff comes for free. You can play at any club or golf course without paying a dime. And if you are good enough to earn sponsors, you would not have to pay for many other things. However, being a PGA Pro doesn't mean you don't pay fees. A PGA player exempted from qualifying doesn't have to pay entry fees for tour events, but he'll be required to pay a $100 initiation fee then another $100 in annual dues. The only expense he would need to play in a tournament is a mandatory $50 locker room fee. Most players spend a lot of time on the road and have to pay for their travel expenses, but some tournaments have charter flights for players. Two of the most used charter flights are from the US Open to the Travelers Championship and the John Deere Classic to the British Open. But if you'd like some privacy, you can always decide to travel on your own. NetJets have a partnership with the PGA Tour, and they provide their services to the 30 top-ranked PGA players. Since 2014, NetJets has been responsible for privately flying PGA Tour champions, FedEx Cup winners, and seven of the top 10 world-ranked golfers. If you play in the Live Golf Series, things can be quite different. Live golfers don't just get to travel on private planes, they also party on them. Live Golf is the money tour. Caddies travel on private planes with their golfers, and Liv covers travel and accommodations for all 48 players and their caddies. Agents and coaches are also covered in Liv Golf. Even if a golfer misses a cut, they can shoot eight over par each round and earn around $120,000 weekly. Speaking about travel, PGA pros always get courtesy cars on tour. This is standard, no matter the event. It is just another one of the tour's perks. Another perk as a PGA player that helps ease the stress of their nomadic lifestyle is free dry cleaning or laundry. This may not sound like much, but nobody likes doing laundry, so having it done for no charge doesn't sound bad. As a PGA player, you don't just get free dry cleaning, you also get free food. For example, you get free on-course food trucks during the rounds at the Honda Classic. The tour ensures its players never go hungry, even on the road. Don't forget, there's also player dining at the course during events. The PGA Tour believes in the saying, happy wife, happy life. So they make sure that the wives of PGA players have some perks to themselves. As the wife of a PGA player, you get free passes to spas frequently available at events. You also get handbags and jewelry at times. When it comes to accessories, the men are not left out. PGA players have their pick of luxuries like belts and sunglasses. You have to be good to be on the PGA Tour, so you need to look good too. Plus, fans expect to see a certain kind of swag in the players. They can't be caught lacking. Most PGA players have families, and the tour ensures kids are not left out. During events, there are day trips for the kids of the pro players. For example, families have access to Universal Studios at the Arnold Palmer Invitational in Orlando. At other events, the kids get free access to zoos, aquariums, and other fun places. All work and no play don't do anyone any good, so the PGA makes sure the players can have some fun too. Golf can be mentally draining, and players sometimes need something to take their minds off the pressure. The PGA plans day trips for adults just like the kids. It also plans slow-paced activities for the less adventurous players. Sometimes the players get cooking classes with executive chefs or an outdoor barbecue with their families. For those who like adventures, the PGA Tour allows players playing in the Zurich Classic to drive race cars at the Nala Motorsports Park. And if you ever find yourself at the BMW Championship as a PGA player, you get to test drive BMWs. 
Keeping the fun rolling for its players, the PGA Tour ensures players get game tickets. PGA players get free tickets to see the Red Sox play at the Deutsche Bank Championship. Partaking in other sporting events while on a tour stop is just one of the many other perks of being a PGA player. So what does it take to earn a lifetime membership on the PGA Tour and keep enjoying sweet perks like this for life? We might have exaggerated at the start when we said all you had to do was just one thing. The milestone every PGA player must cross to obtain a lifetime membership on tour is to win 20 PGA Tour events. Golf is very competitive, and the best players play on the PGA Tour, so that's not easy to accomplish. If you have 20 PGA Tour wins in your career, you earn a lifetime membership and get to keep that membership no matter how well or badly you play for the rest of your career. However, you can lose voting rights if you don't play at least 15 events in a PGA Tour season. Before now, the requirements for a lifetime membership also included 15 seasons of PGA Tour service, but that was removed in 2022. Being a lifetime member of the PGA Tour doesn't mean you can get into any event you want, and according to the PGA Tour priority order, lifetime members are in category 17. This means they are behind the last five winners of the four major golf championships. In the PGA Tour, two players compete under lifetime membership status. These players are Vijay Singh and Davis Love III. Players like Phil Mickelson and Tiger Woods have already earned the status but are not actively using it. Dustin Johnson and Rory McIlroy have also earned lifetime PGA Tour memberships. Like every other professional sports league, the PGA has a retirement plan for its members, and of all the professional sports leagues, the PGA is one that enriches its players the most. Ron Price, the chief operating officer of the PGA Tour said, everything we pay out has to be earned, including retirement money. It's our long-standing objective that if a player makes a career on the PGA Tour, they should have a secure retirement. We make sure we're always funding adequately for everyone, but there has to be a competitive element. According to reports, over 600 PGA golfers have over 100 million in their retirement accounts, and about 114 have more than 3 million. PGA golfers can earn their retirement funds in two ways. One is by making the cut at a tournament. As long as they play in 15 events, every time a PGA golfer makes the cut for a tournament, $4,800 goes into their retirement accounts. The other way to earn retirement money is by finishing as one of the top 150 golfers for the year. Each player in the top 150 gets FedEx plan bonus money. The number one player gets $15 million as a bonus. That's $14 million in cash and $1 million in deferred retirement income. If you find yourself at number 150, you get $70,000 as deferred income. For golfers who rank from 31 to 150, their bonus is earned as deferred retirement income. Your retirement plan is secured as long as you keep playing competitively as a PGA golfer. The opportunities and perks available to a PGA golfer are numerous. And for the top golfers, there is serious money to be made. The rule of golf is that the better the player and the more consistently they win, the more they earn. Good players always get the biggest sponsors and endorsements. With endorsements, the possibilities open to a PGA golfer are endless. They can get free golf equipment, automobiles from car manufacturers, gadgets from technological companies, and clothing from clothing brands. Some players even get involved in financial businesses due to their sponsors. Endorsements are the biggest way golfers earn money. The placement and exposure of the endorser's logo are significant. For instance, a business may pay a player a premium, reportedly up to $500,000, to have its brand on their hat, golf bag, or the chest of their golf shirt. Even caddies can get extra money by sporting a branded hat or sporting a logo on their shirt sleeve. In 2021, Tiger Woods barely earned $200,000 on tour due to injuries, but due to endorsement deals with huge brands like Nike, Bridgestone, TaylorMade, and more, he made nearly $62 million. According to PGATour.com, the average PGA golfer earned under $1.5 million in 2021 as prize winnings. In 2021, John Rahm was the money leader on tour, earning $7.7 .7 million. In 2021 alone, four PGA golfers, John Rahm, Patrick Cantlay, Bryson DeChambeau, and Colin Marikawa, earned more than $7 million. If you enjoyed this video about the perks of being a PGA golfer, Check out the video on the screen now, or the one we posted below, because we're sure you'll like that one too. See you there!